In late June, the Chinese Communist Party, or CCP's Politburo, passed a resolution to expel former Politburo member and defense minister Wei Fenghua from the party, accusing him of being a Xi Die. According to language log, the word Xi Die is difficult to translate into English. Xi Die in Chinese is understood as a term for scholars and aristocrats who have experienced moral degradation. However, under CCP rule, China's Xi Die changed its meaning. South China Morning Post cited Chinese experts, saying the CCP often uses Xi Die to mean betrayal. An unnamed expert from Renmin University of China explained that when an official is referred to as Xi Die, it means they are being likened to historical figures harshly condemned by the CCP for treason, such as Xiang Zhongfa or Gu Shunjiang. During the civil war with the CCP, the Guomintang captured Xiang and Gu, who then surrendered to them. As a result, the two men have been strongly condemned and cursed by the CCP media system to this day. Commentator Liang Guoliang mentioned that the CCP's use of the term Xi Die to describe Wei Fenghua indicates that he is suspected of more than just accepting bribes. The use of this term suggests that Wei may have helped the CCP's adversaries to gain an advantage. The rivals of the CCP that Liang mentioned are understood to be the U.S. and the West. It's therefore possible that Wei disclosed classified information to the U.S. and the West, similar to the accusations against former foreign minister Tin Gang and a group of rocket force generals. These incidents indicate that high-ranking officials could potentially betray Xi and the CCP at any time.